Okay, Andy wants to know if you ever have gone. Even if you don't like the gift, the it's gift still a is gift. a gift, and it's the thought. Absolutely. Unless it's like a gag gift of coal or something weird like that. Do you ever go to the theater on Christmas Day to check out new movies, or is you that? You know what? That's f that's a great question. For quite a few years, we made that a tradition. When my mother was alive and when she would come to visit us from Chicago before she moved in with us here in the Cleveland area, which was, um, that was 04 that she moved into with us. But prior to that, when she would just come and visit, um, there were several years in a row where we went on Christmas Day to see a movie. I'll never forget you know, because we'd, we'd uh, go to Mass on Christmas Eve and then Christmas morning open presents and then we'd have all day. So we would go somewhere in the afternoon. And I'll never forget that we went to see, my mother and Jackie and I went to see Schindler's List on the east side. It was only at one mall on the east side and it was a blizzard. And we made it. And um, I'll never, it was, it was, un, it was packed. There wasn't a seat in the theater and as people were waiting in line to get into the theater emotions were running so high there was cussing and almost fights breaking out that's how emotion oh my goodness that's how emotionally anticipated that tremendous film by spiegelberg was starring liam neeson and ray fines and i consider that movie one of the greatest of all time without question 1993 seven oscars best picture I think a lot of people go to the movies on Christmas Day. It's a great little yes. tradition. And, and there's, like a, you there's said. a couple of uh, opening up, uh, yeah. I think Concussion, Concussion is opening up, Reverent with the Mexican director. I can, I got to learn how to pronounce his name, especially because I take Spanish and go to Mexico every year. He is uh, the same director that directed Birdman last year, Best Picture of the Year. And he has a, a, a wilderness movie, a pioneer movie this year called Reverent, starring Leonardo DiCaprio who, and Hardy, who has, uh, uh, DiCaprio's never won an Oscar. He's been nominated never, several times, never won. 